I first heard about keys from Miss Williams. I had asked because it was on the door and I didn't really know anything about it, but I figured it was a big deal like Neha had said. The National Art Honors Society was presented the opportunity to create artwork for the Keys Scholarship Program, and we discussed how would we select six artists, decided that we would interview kids like it was a real job. The first time I heard about Keys was actually at an NAHS meeting, and I heard that there would be interviews for it, and I thought, okay, this sounds interesting. I brought it up to my mom to see if I would have time in my schedule, and when I said Keys, she was like, oh, your sister's involved in that, and I was like, really? She goes, yeah. And I thought, okay, well, this is interesting. That's, you know, something that I might be able to contribute my personal experience with, I guess. So I interviewed for it, and I heard about the scholarship aspect. And I thought that that was an amazing idea, and I really, really wanted to be a part of that. Whenever I found out that we were doing this key scholarship artwork, that we're putting it together, I got interested into it because I know my mom, she had something to do with that. And so I wanted, I was interested and I wanted to get involved with it and see what it was all about. Um, I heard that it was going to be a group effort, that we are going to do a painting, so I thought it was going to be real fun, so I decided to try out. I really wanted to try out because it sounded like a totally different experience from a solo art project. So all of the students uh, presented their work to us and they uh, shook our hands just like a real job interview and proceeded uh, to answer questions in the interview and from there they were selected. I remember when we first began how we started talking about what Keys actually was and we didn't like, because you're not going to jump into something that you have no idea what it is and I remember Miss Huffness Williams wanted to really show us as a whole, like what Keys is really all about. You know? So we explored some ideas about what is a mentor, what does that look like, what does that feel like, and recorded some ideas and some words first. Mm -hmm. Well, in the initial brainstorming, I remember we uh, searched for commonalities among everybody's ideas, and uh, it, it just grew from there. That we started everything by like looking at what it's about and everything, and um, I guess we didn't really know what to do at first, but I know that what we really need to have was a lot of heart and warmth into the project. Um, coming up with ideas that we thought stood out and what we wanted to reflect in the piece, I remember Dalton coming up with the idea of um, sketching. And we all had separate, you know, visions of what first popped into our mind about, you know, growth or, oh, you know, we need to have heart, so we want a key, we want, you know, plants, no, we want trees, no, we want, you know, we want a city, different ideas, and I thought, amazing to see how that came together in our final piece. Uh, we came up with the idea of the tree because it gave us, um, it was like a blooming of, of the ideas the kid had. I think having all of us, like just um, Miss Huffman and Miss Williams, like pick each of us to, you know, be an artist and contribute to it, it really like brought, they saw like the different strengths we had and different like unique artistic ways we had. And so I guess, I don't, I don't even think any of us knew, but we somehow like brought it together and like, I don't know if I'm talking on topic, <laughs> but brought it together and um, created something like really different and unique with all our different skills and strengths. My main contribution to the piece was the hand. It's symbolic of the Keys Committee being able to lift um, mm -hmm. people up and to that higher place that they're trying to achieve such as the kid and in the piece. I feel wonderful about it. I really do. Something we all was kind of common that we were sure of is how when we started thinking of our ideas, we started thinking of like words, like strength and potential and courage and um, well, hope, you know, those kinds of things. And I know that that was something immediately that we wanted to um, incorporate into the piece. That was something that we were definitely certain that we wanted to use because those have to do with how, you know, a mentor brings out those things mm -hmm. in the student. So we finally came down to finishing the piece and it is a relief above all <laughs> that 
we finally come to the stage. We we can barely believe it that we are yeah. that we <laughs> made it here. here. But as with all art, it um, generally feels like you're never quite never quite done. Mm -hmm.